Today in our 2014 Jeep Grand Cherokee, we're going to take a look at and show you how to install the Curt T-Connector Vehicle Wiring Harness for the factory tow pack. This offers the 5-pole flat trailer connector, part number is C56515. As you can see, the wiring harness here is going to be extremely simple. We've got a standard US style car connector. We're going to plug this into the back of the Grand Cherokee at the plug that's located just above where your hitch will be mounted. This is going to give us the standard four flat light functions, but it's going to add in the reverse signal. This wire comes into play most often in marine trailer applications where they have surge brakes. This is going to activate the electronic override when you shift into reverse. The other functions are going to be right turn and brake, left turn and brake, running lights, and then of course we've got a ground wire here that grounds the system out and makes sure all of our lights work for us. They've provided a dust cover. This is just going to fit around the plug keeping dust and moisture out. And I also like to use this to attach it to our hitch. Now one thing to keep in mind, if your Grand Cherokee did not come with the tow package activated, after you get this mounted, you're gonna have to go to the dealership and have them activate that package for you so all of your lights will work properly. Now to begin our installation, we need to find our connector. We're at the back of the vehicle, here's the center. It's gonna be on the driver's side, just up on top of the fascia. Kinda see it right in here. We'll slide that off its connector. It'll pull it up and see this tab right here. If you push down on that, you can pull the cap out, exposing the wiring plug. Now we're going to add a little dielectric grease to that. If you don't have it, this is part number 11755. This will just keep any moisture from getting in here, causing corrosion. Now we'll take the plug from our kit, plug it in, we want to squeeze it so we hear the tab click. You should be able to pull it at that point without it separating. Now you can decide how you want to route the wiring. So I'm going to bring it down the front side of the hitch, bring a loop over around the safety chain connection point to hold it, and then we can use a couple of zip ties here to get both our plug and wiring safely secured above the hitch. Now we're ready to go have the tow package activated. And that's gonna complete our installation of the Curt T-Connector vehicle wiring harness with the five pole flat trailer connector, part number C56515. Thanks for watching. Click the link in our description below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com. And leave a comment if you have any questions.